what's up guys, it's Travis Flips. Welcome to my Poké Lab and today we're gonna open some Shining Fates tins. Alright guys, so today I have a special one for you today. Alright, we're not just gonna open one, but let me just try to grab these two. Okay, but all three of them. So originally my plan was to go down to the Pokemon Center because I wanted to see whether they have any Galarian Rapidash V boxes. And also I saw from the official store that they actually had the mini tins um, in stock as well. So that was my list, all right? I, I was getting either the, the Galarian V boxes if they were there or the mini tins. But sadly, when I went down to the Pokemon Center, they had none of these in stock. I took a risk and it didn't pay off this time. But they had some other products including the Shining Face tins. So to be honest, I still want to try my luck at the Charizard. To me, it's the best looking Zard in the modern era besides the Hidden Face one. And also, if you see my previous video, you know that these tins actually treat me better than the ETBs or the booster boxes. Alright guys, so these tins are directly from the Pokemon Center. And I didn't choose, I literally just took the first row. Um, from the shelf, I didn't choose like lucky number or whatever, just the first row that was there on display and we shall see whether the ones, these random ones from the Pokemon Center, whether the pool rates are better. Oh guys, one more thing, make sure you stay until the end of the video as I'll be giving my thoughts on whether these tins are worth your money. So guys, let's crack this open. Alright guys, so firstly, I want to show you how these tins look close up. So we have the bottom V box and as you can see the promo card here and the tins I gotta say the design the artwork is pretty spectacular pretty awesome all right these are the sides so I think the sides are all the same this one is the Elder Goss check out the promo card and the last one what's the name of this Pokemon Cremorant V so these are awesome, awesome looking boxes. Okay guys, so let's begin. I think we shall begin with the Cremorant V box. Okay, so from the slide, there's actually these um, very easy opening. Oh. And the box is open. Let me know in the comment section, guys, what do you think of these boxes? And wow, I'm pretty surprised it, it actually opens it slides open pretty easy compared to the hidden uh, hidden tins boxes. Okay, I had a super hard time opening and closing those tins. Okay, so in each of these tins, you actually get one promo card. So you can see the Cremorant V looks absolutely amazing. All right, and then inside you get five um, Shining Fates packs. All right, so we're going to open all 15 of these and just the empty box. All right, so let's keep this aside. Boom. See? And show you guys the, the promo card. Check out the shine, guys. All right. And let me put this aside. We have the five packs. Okay, let me just put this aside. All right. And lastly, we have the Bolton. All right. So let me just open this up. Show you guys the promo card this this is definitely my my favorite promo card um, out of these three and check this out all right we have the we have two zards over here two zard artwork so this is the bolton uh tin okay moment of truth we are ready all right so let's put this aside so let's begin with the cremorants um these are from the cremorants all right Let's go. First pack magic. Shinx. Boom! Our first hit is a Flappo. Shiny baby. I don't have this one, so this is pretty cool. Alright, and the Mana Free card. Okay, so pretty good start. We have the Flappo. Shiny baby, nice centering. The back looks very good as well. Okay, so very nice start. And boom! What a hit! Our second hit is a Lapras V and a shiny Luxray, a hollow Luxray. Pretty good, pretty good, guys. It's all in the tins, man. How many times do I have to tell you? 
the centering is so so off center if you can see wow but this is my first Laplace head so I like it a lot check out the back you gotta love Lapras, man one of the OG Pokemon so we are two out of two let's put it aside here all right third pack let's go nice EV I like this EV a lot a buizo and boom we have the Dragapult shiny baby yes I don't have this as well this is one of my favorite shiny babies actually um, I love this pseudo legendary from Sword and Shield I think it's really really badass and guys just take a close up centering is very very decent I have to say all right guys what do you think of this PSA 10 worthy let's take a look at the back ah I think that's a bit of um, dent just a little nick over there over there but my gosh I like this a lot so we have three hits two shiny babies and one um, Lapras V and this is our fifth pack let's go oh no <laughs> it's a reverse order okay and a Cramera V Max okay so we did have a V Max hit after all okay so I, I don't consider this a hit I mean all right so this is pretty cool so this is from from one single tin I would say that the hit rates are, are pretty good we are back with our second um, second set of booster packs so this one is from the Elder Gods V tin all right Spinorak and oh a Rowlet shiny baby very good very good I'm getting all the hits that I didn't get and I must say that I'm liking all these shiny babies much better um, than the ones I pulled from the ETB uh, Chuto, EV, Nikit, Horsey what's this? oh nice 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 we hit a Toxtricity VMAX let's go guys that, that scared me for a bit to be honest when I saw this right I was like damn but I still take this I still take this this is still a very very cool card um, centering is a bit right heavy okay but check out the shine um, this is probably my second VMAX shiny VMAX that I've hit beautiful beautiful the thing about this uh, that impresses me the most is the texture itself all right check out the texture a buizo I already saw something boom it's a double V and a hollow in DD okay so I don't have this as well I didn't pull this before as well all right so second team I would say very very good we hit a V we hit a V max and we have one shiny baby all right guys let's go let's go moment of truth this is from the Bolton tin all right so let's let's start with the Charizard V max uh, pack cute fun what's this oh ho, 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 amazing rare Kyogre and a Volcania wow i forgot this existed in the set and this is my first um amazing rare kyogre i believe the first one i hit was the um the Ivuto. so this is my first time seeing um this kyogre and if you see my post i love amazing rares a lot i have probably like four or five of those uh, amazing rare celebes okay so take a look at the back just check out the, 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 the splash it just hits different guys look at the rainbow tone and the colors oh amazing I, I like this a lot I forgot this existed a group key and oh a shiny baby Dandy Dandy Dandin no idea how to pronounce this sorry my first time hitting this as well and um, I think some of you may love this all right so it's up for sale I mean if you, if you guys want this let me know 
and oh nothing what a bad way to end the video all right let's summarize our hits all right guys so this is a summary of our pools i would say that on average you get about three um to four good good hits from each tin so starting with the cremorant v so this is the promo card okay um this is the flappo shiny baby that we pulled a uh, lapras v i think this is probably my favorite a dragapult bit shiny baby okay and from the elder elder gods v tin we have the promo card we have a cremorant v max we have a WV and we hit probably the best card um, over here, the Toxtricity VMAX. And in the bottom bo box, actually hit an amazing rare. So that's pretty cool. I think Rolette was from the, the earlier boxes, earlier tin. But anyway, still a nice hit. Probably the worst one. And uh, then the knee. Okay, so that's my hits. So do I think that you should get these um, these tins? I mean, to be honest, I don't think the value adds up. If you take a look at, let's see this one, all right? So I bought them at 47, but you could probably get them at 40, all right? The Pokemon Center, for some reason, sells them uh, more expensive. So this, you could probably sell at five. Okay, so we're talking about five, five. This is zero. I don't think anyone wants this. Um, Five, I guess and this is maybe like 5 to 10 so we're looking at probably 20 25 max 30 dollars all right um, for the actual value of the hits itself okay so that does not make up at all if we talk about say this one all right so this is enough from the other tin so toxicity I, I don't know how much this has fallen probably this is a 10 15 dollars cut five so say 20 for these 25 30 all right so even if you get something good like this i mean it's still if you were to base them on the value itself it's just 30 dollars 35 dollars so it definitely doesn't make up for the price um, of the tin as compared to the pikachu v box um so dragapult lapras i think this one is maybe 30 dollars 35 max so the only reason to be honest with you guys why people will keep on chasing shiny fates um, tins or other shiny fates products for that matter is just for the zard all right it's just for the zard and it can be a very painful journey it can be a very very it will be a very expensive um, game so i don't know like this is probably unless i get like um interested in it again in the future this is probably my last shining fates um, opening for any products i do still want to open uh, try my luck at the mini tins the set of five mini tins um, but i'll have to decide all right because <laughs> this is this has already to be honest this has eaten into my budget really this is like 150 bucks really all right so i think i'm gonna stop here for now and um yeah because there's so much more products coming up guys um this month and next month so we're gonna focus on all those all right so once again if you like this video please um consider subscribing to my channel share this content i greatly appreciate it let me know in the comments guys what were your best pulls what's your experience from um this uh, shining fake tins <laughs> man if only this was the zard but i guess end of the day is it's just a big lucky draw all right okay guys thank you so much for your time i'll see you in the next one bye